All right, so I just want to quickly explain um, how to deal with a problem with an electric field going between two mediums. So imagine we have this boundary right here, and this medium is air, and we have a permittivity of epsilon zero. And then here we'll have this other dielectric medium that has a permittivity of three epsilon zero. Now we're gonna have some electric field that's coming out So this is our electric field, and that's the one that's coming out, right? So we can call this E1, and there's going to be an electric field that's going in. And we'll have this angle right here, we'll just ma make it uh, 45 degrees. And so then there's this electric field that's going in, and this is some other angle, Z2. Okay, so what we have to do is we want to figure out what the angle is. So first what we're going to do is we're going to be breaking up the components of E1 and E2 into the uh, x and y direction. So I'm going to get rid of E1 and I'm going to have right here is going to be my E1 tangential and then right going this way is going to be my E1 normal. Okay. And then similarly for E2 we're going to have E2 uh, normal and then this way I'm going to have E2 tangential okay so if we uh, going back to boundary conditions um, we have to realize that our E1 tangential equals our E Two tangential. So we know that our E1 tangential, which is equal to, to E1 times, uh, it's going to be, let's see, E1 tangential is going to be sine of 45. Okay? So now um, what we're going to be able to do is we're going to get the um, the normal components. So the normal components do not equal to each other. E1 normal does not equal to E2 normal. But what is equal is going to be D1 normal equals to D2 normal. Sorry. Equals to D2 normal. Right? Now D1 normal is going to be equal to epsilon 0 times E1 normal and then D2 normal equals 3 epsilon 0 times E2 normal. So then we can say that D1 normal divided by uh, 3 epsilon 0 equals Oh, I'm sorry, this is E. Um, E1 normal divided by 3 epsilon 0 equals E2 normal divided by epsilon 0. So hopefully you can see that. I just put this there and then this there. And then I divided by the epsilons. So I can cancel these out. So I'm going to have E1 normal equals 3 E2 normal or maybe better would be E2 normal equals 1 third E1 normal. Okay, so let's just take a step back and see what's the point of all this anyway. So we know that um, I'm going to draw this triangle for our E1, right? So here's E1, and we know, right, we, we found out this angle is 45. So then, you know, we know this angle would be 45. And this is going to be our E1 tangential. And, sorry, this is wrong. This is going to be our E1 normal. And this will be our E1 tangential. 
Now we've got here, um, we've got our E2, right? We got our E2 triangle. So I'm going to move this over a little bit. Uh, let's move it down here. So we've got this this other triangle, right? And you know we have this angle theta here, so that's going to be the same as this angle theta here. And so we said that this is our this is our E2, and this is our E. Um, this is our E2 tangential, and this is our E2 normal. Now we said that our E2 tangential is our equal to our E1 tangential, so this is the same thing as this. So I could rewrite this. I'm just going to equals E1 tangential, and then we could say that our E2 normal is going to be equal to one third E1 normal. Okay. So, um, so how do we figure out this angle? Well, we know that uh, tan of our angle theta is going to be equal to tan equals opposite over adjacent, right? tan equals opposite over adjacent, right? So tan equals E1 tangential over one third E1 normal. And we know that tan of uh, 45 equals to uh, E1 tangential over E1 normal. So then I can times this by 3. So then 3 tan theta equals E1 tangential. Oh, actually, no, this, this, is, this is the same thing as 3. So this is actually, if I times the top and bottom by 3 over 3, this becomes 0, this becomes 1. So then it's 1 third tan theta equals this. And then E1 normal, which is equal to tan 45. So then tan theta equals to 3 tan 45. Um, and therefore, uh, theta equals to 3 tan equals to inverse tangent of 3 tan 45.